Well, hello, hello. Today is going to be a bit of a shorter radio. And yeah, I don't know. I haven't had a great day today. I heard yesterday when I picked up my truck that I had an air leak. And since I didn't get a load out today, I figured I'd take the truck into the shop and get that fixed. And I had found on the one air valve there was one hose that was leaking air and so i told him to replace all of those hoses there was uh, four bigger hoses that were coming into that valve so i told him to replace those hoses they are going to the brake pods and so they did that and replaced the air valve there and once i was all put back together i was still having problems um, i still had an air leak so they discovered that my abs valve was leaking as well and so uh, just one thing after another so i had to cancel that i wouldn't be available today at all and uh, penners also did no longer have any more time to repair that air valve they would have to order it in and it would only come tomorrow but they wouldn't have any time tomorrow to put it in and then the day after is the first so i really have no way of getting that done so what i ended up doing is uh, eh, my uh, normal shop that i usually go to they are closed till the fifth so i had to go find me a different shop which i did and they're going to take care of me so they said they would take me in tomorrow and they would try and get me in there as much as possible and they would try and sneak me in whenever they could and hopefully get me done so we'll see uh, if i can get me uh, my truck finished here tomorrow uh, that's just a really stressful situation you know i expected to go out today and no i won't even be able to go out tomorrow because it's going to take them all day because they said that they didn't have much time either but they would try and get me in whenever they could right so here we are and apparently those abs valves are really expensive they were telling me here at penner's shop that they could run up to a thousand dollars for that one valve you know so yeah that's not a not a day to be smiling but uh, hey what can you do right you gotta get that stuff fixed and I guess sometimes you gotta lose money in order to make money right so but whatever we'll take care of business and hopefully we can go with the day after then right but yeah and then what I did is uh, during the day well since I'm just sitting around at home I uh, we had done some renovations here at, on the home a year before that already <laughs> not even this year I mean this is already 2015 when you're watching this but I didn't do the renovation in 2014, I did it in 2013. And there's always, you know, as, as most of you probably know, when you do a little bit of renovation, you always have a little stuff that gets left over, right? So I finished doing that stuff. Uh, these little springs uh, that go on the bottom on the floor there, so your doors don't hit the walls. Put all of those in there. I got a bunch of those taken care of. We never did that. So I got that all taken care of and then uh, I uh, had hit a uh, metal bar uh, two winters ago with our snow blower and so one of the uh, propeller inside the snow blower was bent and it's sort of broken I need to get it welded together. So what I did I took the whole snow blower apart and now I just got to get it welded together and we should have a good snow blower again because we probably will get some snow yet this year you know it's only <laughs> december 30th right now but uh yeah anyways i think that's about all i got for today just figure i'd give you guys a little bit of a video on how my day has been and what i've been up to and all that stuff you know so uh I guess for that we'll see.